oldest on well, my land was a Queen's building. It's one of the oldest hospitals here. Here in there's an old thing drink fountain there. One of the oldest uh, hospitals uh, here it's still standing. Which is pretty awesome. It's nice that. But we are uh, gonna go up here as a, as a central line turns. I'll show you where the road turns. It's a bit further up. Central line cuts into this road here. So central line, literally under this road, you wouldn't even realise it. It got to go down here anyway, under a big building. I've got to go all the way down to the end. It's quite a journey actually, under these big buildings. You wouldn't believe the central line comes down here, would you really, when you think about it? This is an interesting area because it's got the School of Biology and Science. Yeah, it's up there somewhere. I like how the buildings changed, but I filmed further down the line because they're passing public buildings, so yeah. Yeah, it's hospitals. This part of the hospital. Old school, isn't it? But yeah, it turns into houses now. We can check them out and see where we are. By these bins, you know. <laughs> nice colours, don't you think, guys? Anyway, could get to the end of this road. There's a tra main line, train line in the way. So we can find an underpass that goes under it. We can do that. Because the central line sort of cutting, it cuts off here somewhere and goes down another road. Uh, but under a house, we could have passed it by now. It's sort of cutting in the middle somewhere here. It's the bit where it cuts in the middle, so we've got to go up, work it out. It's a bit of a twinding, turning. We can't really go in and out of houses here. So I checked on the map, you literally come to a dead end. But what's nice along the route, you get nice pop-up shops along the way. Which is nice, you get nice little off licenses along the way. So uh, grab a drink, so, well, I've got plenty of drink, but I'm saying, if I fancy something different, I pop along the way. But yeah, the train line's in the way. Oh, it's a calf. Huh. Yeah, end of this line, there's literally a calf in the way. And I have to get past that calf. Um, despite I bought my umbrella, the weather's nice, but I'm not chancing it with the rain because it did rain earlier earlier on. Let's try and get past this train line and get underneath it somehow. The line's literally blocking my path. Otherwise, I've got to backtrack my route by about five minutes. I'm going to find a way. There's no. Um, if there's a tunnel under somewhere, brilliant. I can go parallel line to the train line and just walk off slightly and don't miss the Bethnal Green station. But yeah, this main line's in the way. It's nice to see an old design along the route. Is that a tunnel? Is that a tunnel? Is that a shortcut? Would you believe I'm in luck? There's actually a tunnel to go under. Right here. Perfect. Just what I needed. Lovely. This is something different actually. You can't complain. It's a nice route. But then again, you've got buildings in the way. I need to go in that direction to the right. But yeah, because Bethlehem Green is sort of there. So yeah, Bethlehem Green's proven a challenge actually. All the next ones are going to be interesting. Won't be as bad as this one. Yeah, we're here at the market. But yeah, it's actually got a sign for Bethlehem Green Station, so I've done this right. So yeah, that's a bit of a bonus going underneath. The Bethlehem Green was well, sort of going parallel to the houses all underneath, and I can't really go in and out at these houses. So it's a bit awkward at the moment. But I'll get parallel to the line as possible. This is the closest I can get, otherwise it'd be up and down the streets. Oh, nice watches here. Well, anyway, we'll get straight to the end. 
and then we hit Bethnal Green and then it will be the street the one after that but this is a nice area Bethnal Green area a bit different it's gonna, our route's going to change somewhat really hectic there will be lots of taxis, lots of buses as we hit the city so it's going to start to change as we leave Bethnal Green it's going to start to change slightly and then as we get to Liverpool Street we're hitting this we're in the city and we're gonna see things gradually change all differently. But yeah. But the Liverpool Street might bank and there's, there's two ones I get confused. I've got my maps. I've got maps up London as well, but I've got my map because it shows me where the central line is. Which helps, so I need to follow that. Mmm, I smell chocolate. I literally smell chocolate. Literally. Hmm. I like the different buildings and the designs here. Very interesting. Okay. Let's get to Bethnal Green. Uh, Bethnal Green Fire Station. They've got a very old buildings here. Fascinating buildings. Bethnal Green Station is just down the bottom here. And uh, we're just going to work out uh, where to go from here to the Bush Street, which would be more interesting. We must be careful because we don't want to go to Shoreditch. This could be slightly. This could be a uh, rumble. There is a way to get there, easy, but I'm following the central line, so that's what makes it more of a challenge, which is interesting. We've got a nice park here. A nice, beautiful park just here. Here in Bethnal Green. Which is pretty sick. This Bethnal Green Park. It's all built. It's called Bethnal Green Gardens, actually. Place to chill out. It's, 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 it's a lot miniature park in the city, basically. But yeah, the station's just up here. Let's get to the underground station so you can see the underground sign. So you know I've actually uh, arrived at Bethnal Green. So I haven't fooled you from each station. Right, this is Bethnal Green. I can tick this off my list. I like the bit of art, it's so random. But fascinated at the same time. Like a Muriel. Yeah, I'll have a look at that in a minute. But yeah, here we are at Bethnal Green. I'm going to check the map in a minute. And we're going to walk from here. We've got to work out where we've got to go. Yeah, this is Bethnal Green. Tube shelter started. Start disaster. It March 1943. When air raid warning surrounds, so yeah, I thought I appreciate this. I like the flowers here. I thought I'd appreciate this one here before I continue my walk. I like these flowers. that you think? These are really nice flowers, actually. That's oh, so cool. I've got the daffs up there. Nice memorial uh, bench. And yeah, all the people. There's people's names up there. It's nice they do this. Memories, basically. And they've got all the names on the plaque. They've got passed away. Yeah, it's a nice what they've done here. I quite like it. And I quite like the flowers over here. These are nice. I, oh, the pollen's really bad for me. <coughs> I've got hay fever, so it's not great for me. But yeah, look at the flowers here. Anyway, let's work out where we've got to go from here. I'm sure it's that way. Just going to check the tube map. Go. Road map. Not tube map. We're doing tube line. Just gets right. Mistakes stay in the video because they make them interesting. <laughs> okay. Chimes for 12 o'clock. It's 12 o'clock now. Just timed it right. So we got here for lunchtime. Ish. <laughs> 